Hey everybody, I wanted to make another video in addition to the one I made regarding those temples. As an addition, I wanted to show you what Ari Schwaller de Lubitsch uh, did with the Temple of Man. And this is the Temple of Luxor in Egypt that you see right here. And here is how he placed the human body on the temple. And as I said before, as you go to these different rooms, the hieroglyphs that he read, he determined that these rooms were actually uh, depicting in the hieroglyphs that certain part of the body that he's referring to. Now, in this next image here, you can see this is the cover of his book here, The Temple and Man. And I highly recommend that you go pick up a copy of the PDF or uh, buy it if you can. Uh, here's Solomon's Temple right here from... Um, you can find these images right here on templesecrets.info and then I have uh, this image down here and this is also the same thing that uh, Ari Schwaller de Lubitsch did he put this person on top of it right here like this so what I wanted to show you was I wanted to show you the uh, pa Vatican City St. Peter's Square one more time because of the area right here that uh, corresponds to uh, the stomach area and what we actually see in St. Peter's Square and the roads and everything like that I thought it would be beneficial for you to see the similarities that we have here so I have these images up here so here is the Temple of Man right here Luxor and here is the uh, St. Peter's Square that you see right here Let's go ahead and zoom in just a little bit. Now I have this one slightly faded in, and I have this one all the way uh, faded in so that you can kind of see the transition. And what you'll notice is that square sits right on top of the area that's also widened right here, and then it narrows at the exact same point in place that it does here, and it ends in the head. Now you see how these dotted lines go down the legs right here? and right here is where the legs in and I want you to take a look at the roadways let's just zoom into that real quick if you notice these roadways that you see right here and what you see in this image here where the buildings actually end is the level place so what we've really got going on here is a lot of geometry that confirms itself I'm not saying that Bernini actually meant to design it exactly after this temple but it's very clear that he's designed it very similar because we have the area that's the largest and the areas in the stomach and if you notice this central area right here is right where the belly button would be on this person so I thought this would be kinda of interesting for you to see and see how it all plays in with each other uh, this is Vatican City St. Peter's Square versus uh, the Temple of Luxor, which is also called the Temple of Man. And once again, you can see how the body divisions of this, uh, where it comes out, the legs all the way down to the feet, level with the end of where the buildings are right here. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and post an, Im an image link to this so you can kind of analyze it yourself and take a look at it. You guys take care, and I'll talk to you soon. We'll just add this as an addendum to the last video of the temples. All right, y'all take care.